Guys, guys, I'm down here. I just wanted to quickly intro the video and, and say that I didn't really feel like doing my hair this morning. So, um, I'm wearing this hat. I hope you don't mind. <laughs> Press start. Yeah, everyone, down here. Welcome back to Tomodachi Live, where today we are back on Diamond Island. And today we're going to start off by adding one new me character, which has been suggested so many times. And it's a female character as well. So let's add her. It's Princess Bubblegum. And I don't know how, but I managed to get a me that actually has pink hair already. So it's a me that doesn't have to get her hair dyed. I thought I'd have to keep it brown and then get hair dyed later on, but apparently not. So yeah, Princess Bubblegum was suggested so many times. So now we've got Finn and PB as well, which is perfect. Now, first things first, we need to go over to the fountain, and I have been remembering to collect my donations almost every day. So we have about £1,400 already. Let's skip this, and oh my goodness, that's a lot. Look at that. We're up to one and a half thousand. Is that how you say it? <laughs> £1,576.90. pence. Perfect. So apparently there is an event at the fountain. The morning market is open. Let's see who is selling what. Ew. Ew, raw oysters. Okay, we are going to grab three. Let's grab five of those. And we're going to try them all around the, <laughs> the apartment block today. And see who likes raw oysters. Apparently Marceline does because she's giving them out to everyone. Right, someone is at the amusement park today. Let's have a quick look at who's hanging out. We have got, is that Zelda? I think that's Zelda just hanging out on the Ferris wheel. How cool is that? Oh, we've just missed the magic show by 20 minutes. No. Oh, look, look, it's going up higher. Look, there's, a, there's literally a roller coaster. Oh, <laughs> there's literally a roller coaster in the background. Do you reckon we get to ride that at any point? That would be so cool. You're having fun, Zelda. It looks like you're having fun. I just want to see how high up this thing goes. When that pole on the left-hand side goes vertical, I think that's when we're at the highest. Look how high that is. We're up with the clouds. Zero is having a great time. <laughs> there we go. We've reached our highest point. And Zelda, I will leave you to it on the way back down. There we go. Very nice. We also need to check out our me news for today to see what is going on. Finn, what's happening? You're watching me news. Yes, we are. An unbelievable discovery was made today. A fudge was discovered with a best before date that was five years overdue. Whoa! Spider-Man was amazed to find the putrid product at the back of his fridge. <laughs> Spider-Man said, I can't believe it. The date is exactly five years ago today. What? We asked some islanders their opinions. What a waste of time. <laughs> yes, Magic Up. I'm jogging right now. Please get out of my way. <laughs> Thanks for watching. The mystery! Of the fiendish fudge. Oh my goodness. Who'd have thought it? Five years and the fudge was still in the fridge. What a mystery. Okay, right. Let's go and see what's going on in our me apartments. It looks like we have a ton of games to play. Misty is hula dancing her butt off. Look at that. Absolutely amazing. And actually, speaking of hair dye, if we get hair dye, we should probably spray paint Misty's like bright orange because her hair color is a little bit too dark right now. Right. Who has got issues? Right. Here's BB. Look at her. She's so cool. <laughs> I love that she's got pink hair already. Look, look at me. Look at me, PB. There we go. Awesome. Right, who has an issue up here? Magikarp's got a problem. Let's see what's going on with Magikarp right now. Are you okay, buddy? The bottom line is, I'm a serious person. Yeah. <laughs> Magikarp, the serious, serious person. Right. I'd like some new clothes. Okay, that's good. Let's go shopping. I want to get him a decent outfit. So we've got baggy trousers. Those are nice. I guess. Um, we've got a girl's college sweater, men's gym uniform, pajamas, or a striped shirt. I think he will look amazing in pajamas. We need to get these. We need to get these for Magikarp, and let's see how he looks in these stripy pajamas. Can you imagine a Magikarp in pajamas? No? Well, you're just about to find out what it's gonna look like. Here we go. This is gonna be fascinating. Here we go, Magikarp. Enjoy them. Enjoy them. Love them. Yes! Oh, it's perfect! It's so perfect. Oh my goodness, he looks beautiful. Here, have this as a reward. Oh, thanks, buddy. Please, head eye. Head eye. No way! It actually is head eye. 
What? Magikarp is my new favorite me. Okay, so we know what we're doing with that. But first, let's talk to him. I go to bed at the same time every night. And he's talking about bedtime already because he's wearing pajamas. Magikarp, you're my new favorite me. You are awesome. <laughs> Actually, I'm going to do something potentially very weird and give him some... What do we just buy? Raw oysters. I need to try this on every me I visit so far. So let's see. He's eating fish and he's a fish. And he likes it. He likes to eat his own family, kind of. Maybe like his cousin or something. What a strange human being you are. Well, you're a fish, so I guess you're strange. Fish eating fish, guys. Today is already getting weird. Right then, where is Misty? Misty is here. Let's use the hair color spray on Misty to get her hair all sprayed up bright orange. Potatoes. Whoa. <laughs> She's got all potatoes. I'm actually quite a softy when I'm with someone I like. Oh, that's cute because you like Homer. Right, first things first, we need to give you some of your Roy o raw oysters. I can't even say it. There you go. <laughs> Looks so untasty. And they all eat the shell as well, which is gross. Do you like it? No. No, she didn't. Okay, uh, that's fair enough. I was expecting most people not to like it. But I have a present for you. I'm going to give you some hair color spray. Boom. There we go. Right, let's do this. I'd like to have my hair dyed a cute color. A cute color? Not sure about cute. It's gonna be orange. I think this color. Can we try it out or no? Oh, which one? Red or orange? I think it's got to be orange, hasn't it? Yep, yeah, needs to be orange, but we've got like a brownie color. That I think that's gonna be the best. Right. Let's do this. Let's see what it looks like. I think you might get the option to change it or not. Here we go. It's going orange. That's perfect. Oh, yes, that's actually perfect. <laughs> Looking good, Misty. That actually suits your, your shorts as well. Oh, it's all going perfectly today. Magikarp got new pajamas. Misty's got a new shiny head of orange hair. Today is today is perfect already, but we do have a lot of problems. So let's see. Oh, um, Dan TDM is laying in the rain, catching water in his mouth. Treoris. Oh no! Treoris has got a rain cloud. What's going on, buddy? I must be really tired. Oh no! What, what do we give you? Um, oh. I got a cold. Oh, he's got a cold. Oh, no. Well, <laughs> well, it's a good job we've literally got four cold medicines. So here you go. Let's make him feel right as rain. Treros has a cold, everyone. Jeez. Yeah, the medicine worked. Imagine if it didn't work. It'd be the worst cold medicine ever. Gone down. Good. I'm glad, buddy. I feel like there haven't been many new islanders lately. Are you kidding me, Treoris? In the last episode, we added five. The episode before that, we added five. And before that, we added five. And today, we added one. You want more people? Fine, we'll add more people next time. I promise you. Right. I visited you, so unfortunately for you, I need to give some... Where are they? Where are they? Raw oysters. We've got three left to give out. So the next two people are also going to get oysters. What's the verdict, Treoris? Hmm. Okay, he likes it a little. So we've had two likes and one dislike so far, which is which is more than I thought would happen. So who should we visit next? I think we should visit Anna because we haven't visited her much since she arrived on the island. And we also now need to feed her a raw oyster. <laughs> I'd like some spaghetti bolognese. Oh, um, okay. You want spaghetti bolognese instead. Do I have any of that? I don't even know. Um, let's have a look. Got carbonara. I don't have spaghetti bolognese. Oh, no. Oh, no, look. I've run out. Let's see if we can go and buy some. Oh, look, yes. There's actually some here. Oh, perfect. Okay, so let's buy this. Uh, let's just buy one. I'm still going to feed you that oyster. Don't think you're getting away with it just because you requested a certain type of food. Let's see if we get any... I wonder if we get any, like, bonus points for giving her what she wants. I would have thought so, right? There we go. She really, really liked it. That should go on to her likes. But now, she's got a tiny little bit of stomach space. Please take this. Oh, she said something slightly different. I got a camera, another AR camera. Right, we could try that today, maybe, because now we've got two. I don't like using items when I've only got one for some reason, but um, what was I saying? Oh, yeah, I was saying that I still need to feed her an oyster because she's got a little bit of stomach space left. So here we go. It's oyster time here on Diamond Island. And you know what? We could actually buy some more oysters so we feed more people them. Let's see what she's saying about them. Oh, she really, really liked it. <laughs> and she leveled up. Okay, um, nice. It's actually gone to the top of her likes list. 
That's crazy. We're going to give you a beauty kit for your troubles because no one else has liked it that much before. <laughs> See, because you're here, let's play. Okay, let's do that. Let's play a game. Um, What game have you got in mind, cards? Here we go, guys. Here we go. Which one is her tell? I'm going to pick this one. No, that was the wrong one. Don't pick the right one. Don't pick the right one. Ah, no. Oh, jeez. Thank goodness. Okay. Um, Let's pick this one. This one! This one! Yes! <laughs> it took me a while to pick. Look at that thumbs up as well. So cheesy. So cheesy. <laughs> Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you so much. What have you got for me? Oh, we got the three things. Uh, should we go middle or should we go big or should we go small? Um, eeny, meeny, miny, mo, catch trailer by the toe if he screams because he will pick this box. I've gone on big, so... Oh! We've got a waving cat. So if I didn't do the Treora song, I would have picked the middle, which means we've got a fish slice, which is which is terrible. But we've got a waving cat, and I think that's the best out of the three, so that's cool. Oh, Mr. Incredible is now um, selling oysters. Okay, I came back for a little bit of a top-up. I think I'm going to go buy five more, because they're only a pound each, which isn't bad. And I think I want to feed every single person one this time. Uh, where was I going to go? I was going to go to the pawn shop to see how much that cat is worth. What was it called? What was it called? Waving Cat. 57 pounds. That's really good. I think that's one of our highest ones so far. And while we're shopping, let's go and see what's in the hat shop. Oh, look. Princess Bubblegum already has a job, which is crazy. We've got... Oh, oh no. That looks so good. I know who to give that to as well. Oh, geez. Right. A hunting cap and a trilby hat. Right. I need this bobble nightcap. 100%. This needs to go to Magikarp. <laughs> He's going to have a full set of pajamas. We've got an acorn hat as well, a beret, a checked hat, and a weird-looking tulip hat, and a mushroom hat. And a oh, my oh my goodness, there's so many good hats. I'm going to buy them all. I'm going to buy them all. We need a mushroom hat. That looks... So <laughs> You're going to like Toad from Mario. And a mushroom hair clip. Um, are there any other hair clips that I can buy? Because I feel like PB needs one. Hat with ears. I think I've given that to someone already. Um, yeah, I've already got one of those. Maybe I haven't given it to someone. I'm not too sure. Where is the hair clip? Where is the hair clip? There must be one. I've got a sunflower hair clip. Let's get one of those and let's get it in bright yellow. What do you say, PB? Yeah, I think yellow. Yellow is going to be good. Okay, right. Let's buy these and let's dish these out. Oh, man. That was a good hat trip today. Wow. And let's take a peek at interiors. There's Misty with a brand new orange hair. We got pumpkin patch because, well, I was going to say it's October, but it's not. It's September. So we're getting ready for Halloween. Um, Bohemian. Very nice. Very nice. We've got ethnic and pirate ship. Whoa, that's cool. That's really cool. What else have we got? Real cartoon. Um, children's. 50 Japanese and floral. Oh, I don't know. The pumpkin patch is kind of cool, but I can't think who I would give it to. Who could I give the pumpkin patch to? Right, let me dish out the hats first, and then I'll choose who I give the pumpkin patch to. Or I might save it for Halloween. I think I'm going to save it for Halloween. Right, let's go and dish out some hats. We've got some games to play. Oh, man, today is going so well. Oh, Two-Face is dreaming. She's dreaming. Is she dreaming about herself, maybe? Let's see. Let's pop open this dream and see what we get as well, because we get some weird items. Oh. Hello? Um, can I, can I move this? Whoa! Whoa, look at this! <laughs> That's awesome. Can I throw it to the top screen? Oh, no, I can't. Um, oh, no, I broke her. Did you see that? I properly broke her. <laughs> Smash her into the walls. Smash her everywhere. Spin around and throw her! <laughs> this is so cool. She's like, it's like draw a stick man. But in Tomodachi life. That was really cool. Let's see what we get. Maybe like a pencil or something. Oh, a box of matches. I don't know who I want to give a box of matches to. That could be, could be extremely dangerous. Hello, Two-Faced Girl. How are you doing? Oh, I feel most comfortable on my own. That's because you have yourself for company, which is very strange. I'd like some new clothes. Something cattle would be cool. You want some new clothes. Um, let's see what we can buy for you. We've got, I guess, this. We've got the striped shirt combo. Let's go for got autumn dress. We need something kind of weird. You know what? This is kind of cool. I like that. What else have we got? The hoodie and gilet or gilet? I don't know what that what that's supposed to be. Um, I don't know how to say it. <laughs> a quilted coat, a woolly jumper. Um, what else have we got? A Bavarian outfit. Tempting. So tempting. I think this will suit her. I actually think it will. Let's go for the skirt and braces combo. And let's do it in... 
I think light blue. Let's go for light blue and see if she likes it. Here we go. Moment of truth. Here you go, Two-Face girl. Let's see what this looks like on you. There we go. So at least she liked it. She didn't like it a lot, but she still liked it just a little bit. I almost forgot. I need to give you your daily dose of raw oysters. Here we go. What's the verdict going to be on the oysters, huh? What's it going to be? Oh, she liked them too. That's three out of four people like them. <laughs> that is so awesome. I thought everyone would hate them. That's why I'm doing this. Oh, I got a travel ticket as well. Nice. Thank you, Two-Face Girl. That's very I nice of you. Do you? Well, that's probably why you gave me a travel ticket, because you don't want to go on holiday right now. You've already planned it, so... This is going well. The oyster experiment is going really well. Okay, so, um, Sans wants us to play a game. Now, you know what Sans is like? Always up for playing games. So, let's see what he wants to play today. I think cards. Oh, he's gonna... Oh, no! It's the catch game. We haven't had this for so long. The first time and the only time I've done this is when he trolled me. He trolled me completely. Let's press start and see what happens. What is that? Okay, don't trick me. Don't trick me. Don't trick me. Please don't trick me. You're such a tricky character. Here we go. Um. Ah, oh, no. I was so close. So close. I thought he was going to trick me, but he didn't. He might trick me this time. What even is that that I'm trying to catch, huh? Here it comes. Here it comes. Come on. Ah, oh, I missed it again. I waited too long. <laughs> this game is so difficult. Sans, why? And now he's going to give me tissues. Or toilet paper, whichever one. But hey, the joke's on him because you know what? We are going to give him a raw oyster. <laughs> it certainly does, including raw oysters. So today has been a properly raw oyster experiment. We still have four of these to give out. So we definitely need to visit at least four more me's today. Another one likes it. That's... I, I don't even know how many I bought. I bought five at the beginning. Yeah, I've done six. That's five out of six. Five out of six people actually liked it. That's insane. Sans on his maracas as well. Looking beautiful. Right, we're visiting Elsa now. And she has Dan TDM as her brand new boyfriend. I want to sneeze, but I can't. Oh, okay. Um, yeah, I'll help you out. <laughs> Why not? I think we've done this before. It's actually quite difficult. Don, sneeze. Sneeze. Sneeze, go on. Sneeze! Yes! <laughs> I don't think I've ever celebrated someone doing a sneeze. But today is an extra special occasion. I think she'll give us a present. Go on, give us a present. You know, you want to, you leveled up as well. Or I can give you a present too, if you like. Um, what can we go for? A gift of... I'm going to give you bubbles. You might create really cool, like, frozen bubbles. That would be really awesome. <laughs> that would be really cool, actually. Oh, and she did give us a present back. It's like Christmas. Oh, a sewing machine. I don't think we've had a sewing machine before. I could spend a whole month all on my own. Oh, you don't want to do that. Or do you? Because you are Elsa. Right, let's see how many sewing machines we have. We have ourselves two. We do have two. Um, we should give one of those to someone maybe next time. Oh, I forgot to give up. No, where did she go? I need to call her. <laughs> you need to eat an oyster for me. And the next participant in the raw oyster challenge is Elsa. Will you like it or will you not? Here we go. Oh my goodness, seven. Seven out of... No, wait. Six out of seven liked it. That's insane. It's even on her likes. They like... They all like raw oyster. This is supposed to be one of those awful challenges, but it's not. It's turning out to be quite a good day for everyone. <laughs> right, I need to see Craig eat an oyster. Let's see what his problem is. <laughs> I love Craig's outfit and room. It matches perfectly. I've just realized as well he's taking his hat off. I want to sneeze. Why is everyone... Why is everyone trying to sneeze? Right, okay, I'll help you out. I'll let you sneeze. Uh, but yeah, we need to pick a new hat for you, Craig, because you took the bunny one off. Why would that be, huh? And also, also, you have no nose. You have no nose whatsoever, so how are you going to sneeze? Okay, he's just going to sneeze out his mouth. That's fine. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. Thanks. What you got? Um, Ajomatic. Okay, so I can't remember what that does. Oh, where are we going? Oh. Oh. We have a news flash. Okay, what's happening? Let's see. Who's telling us the news? I think it's Zelda. It is Zelda. It's actually Princess Peach. A pampered ranking has been added to the rankings board. Okay. When all is said and done, who does Dan TDM's look alike like best? What? It's the question that every Diamond Islander is dying to know. Oh no. Zelda was worried that she wasn't that well liked, but had to find out. Oh no. She analyzed Dan TDM's look alike's behavior and presented the results to the public. What? The results are always changing, so check it regularly to find out who is the most pampered pet around. 
Thanks for watching. No problem, Princess Peach. So, uh, wow. Okay, so there's a board that tells us how much we're doing for each me. So let's go and see. I don't pick favorites. I don't think so. Let's see who is top. Treoris is top. Then it's Craig. Then it's Dan, TDM. Then Gemma, Skelebone, Misty, Brock, Taylor, Sans, Phil, Elsa, all the way down to the bottom. Harry, Fake Dan, TDM, Toriel, Marceline, and PB. I'm so sorry, guys. I'm so sorry. I'll get you guys involved in the Raw Oyster Challenge. Don't you worry. So who was complaining, huh? Who was complaining? Who actually wants to take part in the Raw Oyster Challenge? I think Fake and TDM, wherever he may be, wants to try it out. Don't get Fake Oyster in your mustache, buddy. You want to take part in the Oyster Challenge? I'm Fake Dan TDM. People always think I'm outstanding. Really? Really? I don't think that's true, buddy. I don't think it's true at I all. I think someday I will make the discovery of a lifetime. Maybe. Maybe. I think not, though. Right. Here we go. How many do we have left? We've got three left. Two. And now that we've given one to Fake Dan TDM, what you're going to think of it? This is amazing. This is absolutely incredible. Everyone but one person likes raw oysters. I can't believe it. I am... I am shocked. And I've never tried raw oysters before. Look, it's given him superpowers. Look how many push-ups he's doing. Oh, man, these oysters are so, so special. Right, we've got two more to give out. Um, who should we go and... Oh, look, Homer's in his mirror. Let's go and see Homer. <laughs> How's it going, buddy? I could never ignore a friend in need. Exactly. Never ignore a friend in need. Right. I'm sorry, buddy. I picked on you. I thought you had a problem, but you don't. But now you do. You got the raw oyster to put in your mouth. Here we go. How many can we make it out of 10? Oh, no. Oh, oh, it was, it was almost sick then. Did you see that? I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Right, I'm going to leave real quick because this was a little bit awkward. So, we have one more left. We've got so many games to play as well. Jeez, um, who should we take a look at? You know what? The final one has to go to me. Let's see how we like it. So, you've also got a problem from Dan TDM. It's been a week since I saw myself. <laughs> I'm going to say I'm so worried when I'm worried. Okay, um, yeah, 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 let's keep it. That's sure. Sure, fine. <laughs> I love Elsa's voice. It's so cute. Oh, that's so cute. Now that boyfriend and girlfriend. Right, I have, um, a special present for you, buddy. Uh, we're gonna go for the raw oyster, the final one. So, out of nine people, two people haven't liked it. Here we go. The final raw oyster challenge. He likes it too. Is it gonna go on his likes? I think it is. It's number one. It seems like if people like it, it goes to number one on their likes list, which is incredible. And I need to give him a gift. Let's go for a... A football or a soccer ball, depending on where you are from. There you go. Catch it. <laughs> Guys, we're out of oysters. So, um, eight out of ten people liked the oysters, which is madness. Thank you, everyone, for taking part in the Raw Oyster Challenge. I was impressed. Right, we've got a Zoom quiz now with Spider-Man himself. So let's see what the Zoom items are. Ooh, lump of coal, honey, or a herring. Now, a herring is a fish, but I think it's... I think it's not dropping my stylus. Lump of coal. I think this is wrong. I should have gone fish. Should have gone herring. It's a lump of coal. Oh, thank goodness. Okay, that's not too bad. Right, next item is... Oh. Do you think it is? A vuvuzela, a tulip, or a mashed potato. This is 100% a tulip. Please be a tulip. If this is a vuvuzela, I'll throw my DS. There we go. <laughs> I was going to say, tulips aren't green, but the leaves certainly are. Final zoom item. Oh, my goodness. A baguette, a maron, or an engagement ring. I don't even know what a maron is, so I'm going to pick that. Here we go. Please. Please. Yes. What's a maron? I have no idea, but I guessed it right. I knew it definitely wasn't the other two, so that was a lucky guess. Right, let's select some more of our little gifts today. Um, eeny, meeny, miny, mo, catch your eyes by the toe if he screams, because he will pick this box. Small. Oh, a dice. Okay, oh, there was a TV. I missed it. Right, so now that we've given out all of our... Um, oh, look, Magikarp's actually sleeping. <laughs> now that we've given out all our raw oysters, we need to dish out a hat or two. Oh. Hey, Magikarp, when you speak, it makes me laugh because your mouth goes really, really wide. Right. Let's give you a, a bubble cap, shall we? This is going to look magical. It's going to look magnificent. Magikarp is going to look beautiful. Frankly, yes. <laughs> he liked it a little. Oh, my goodness. Look at him. Look at his face. <laughs> he can barely see out of his eye holes. That is crazy. Right. What other hats did we buy? 
We bought, um, we had a hat with ears. We got a top hat. Mushroom, pumpkin. I think I'm going to save that for October. Oh, yeah, sunflower hair clip. I need to go and give that to PB to welcome her to the apartment life. Here we go. She's having a great time already. Jeez. Please call me PB. I feel most comfortable on my own. Okay, that's fine. But you feel even more comfortable when you've got a hair clip. There we go. Right, give you this. And let's see what you think of the hair clip. I think it's going to suit her. There we go. That looks so magical. So magical. I always get my magazines from the back of the shelf. Okay, you like the pristine magazines. I like that. Now, shall we feed you something? Let's go for... Let's welcome you to the family with a cheeseburger. I mean, why not? Here we go, cheeseburger. Happy times. Happy, happy times. <laughs> okay, let's play a game. And I think this will have to be the last thing we do today. Another Zoom quiz. Okay, let's see what we've got here. Let's go for... Space food, bacon or bread with chocolate spread. That's bacon. I know bacon when I see bacon. And that is definitely bacon. There we go. 100% <laughs> know my bacon. Definitely. If there's anything I know, it's that food. Uh, right. Torch, peach or chocolate gato. That is the top chocolate. I can't even speak. I'm so excited about the chocolate gato. There's so much food in this episode. Jeez, we've got oysters, chocolate gato, bacon. And finally, we have ourselves milk, potato or a jewelry box. That is... A jewelry box. If that's milk, that's a pretty scary slice of milk right there. It's a jewelry box. Look at that. It's full with diamonds and rubies and magical, magical things. Jeez. Okay, right. What have we got to choose from the box? Now, I'm going to go middle because I've done small and big today. Let's go middle. That is a geode. A geode? Is a geode like a really special rock? I think it is. We need to go to the pawn shop right now and see how much that's worth. Because I have a feeling they're worth quite a bit of money. Geode, geode, geode. 41 pounds. Yeah, look. Crystals in this geode took aeons to form. Aeons equals a long time. <laughs> so there we go, guys. Diamond Island has been absolutely fantastic today. Let's click save to see what's going on here. There we go. Oh, my goodness. Smiley, calm down. You're going to break your neck. Whoa. <laughs> but yes, today has been another stellar day on Diamond Island. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it and the raw oyster challenge, please leave a big fat thumbs up. That'd be greatly appreciated. And if this happens to be the first video you've seen by me, please do consider subscribing to join Team TDM today for daily gameplay videos. Apart from that, guys, thank you again so much for watching. You are the best. Have an amazing day, and I'll see you all in the next video. Goodbye.